Well, spring break is, you know, you're out of the classroom, but you don't want to stop learning during spring break, right? For kids, the answer to that question is probably no. But for parents, the answer is yes. Kyle Shepard with the Louisville Zoo says both kids and parents can get the best of both worlds at the zoo. You're taking a zoo walk with your family and you're learning. You're, you're still in a le learning environment, so you're learning things over your spring break. Spring break camps are obviously a great way to do that. The zoo offers two different camps this week, Adventure Camp and Bright Beasts Camp. Both focus on learning about animals, their habitats, and exploring the zoo up close. They're learning all about animals. They're learning, so doing some activities. Like today, we saw some of the kids making enrichment for some of the animals. So they'll paint boxes and decorate some, some, some boxes or some papers, which will then be given to some of the animals as enrichment. It's not just the zoo that's offering spring break camps this week. JCPS is offering eight different camps focused on activities for students third through eighth grade. The Kentucky Science Center is offering offering schools out science camp for students pre-kindergarten through fifth grade. Louisville City FC is holding spring break soccer camps for sports lovers. And at Bernheim Forest, you'll find camps and daily activities for all ages. We have camps on birds, learning how to hike, um, family camp days on Friday. So there's 16,000 things to do. In addition to camps at Bernheim, Renee Hutchinson says they also offer daily activities for families, like the 14-acre natural play space and discovery stations. We've got our B team set up. They're talking about animals of Bernheim in the area. They talk about trees and plants and wildflowers and everything nature. For a full list of camps and activities going on during spring break, head over to our website, wlky.com. I'm Addie Miners, WLKY News.